When I moved to Birmingham, I came here for the art, the culture, the sense of community. Little did I know how absorbed I would get by niche local attractions. I have travelled from Bell End to Bell End, which is a shorter distance than you would imagine, um, but I have become completely obsessed by the spoon of Cotteridge, uh, an everyday metal spoon embedded in the road in a pedestrian crossing in Cotteridge in the south of Birmingham. Um, I've no idea how we got there. My brain has been coming up with a million convoluted ways in which a fucking spoon could get embedded in a fucking road. Um, and frankly, it's been three years, three years, and I'm no closer to an answer. So today I have come into Cotteridge, my little local village area, to speak to some local people to find out if anybody knows the true origins of the spoon of Cotteridge. Excuse me, sir. You look like a local gent. Could you possibly tell about the origins of the Spoon of Cotteridge? Well, I heard it was left here during the Viking raids, and when they put the road down, they dug it up and they just left it. But that's just what I heard. Excuse me, do you know anything about the Spoon of Cotteridge? Do I? Ugh. Where can I begin? With art movements, you have uh, places like Weimar, where Bauhaus started, and Berlin, London, and you have to be in there early. I found out about this on the dark web in some underground art communities, and well, that's why I moved down from Scotland. I had to be here when you are at what is the focal point of what is a major new movement in art. You can't be at a distance, you have to be there. Cottage is going to be named up there with places like London, Berlin, Paris, New York. Watch this space. Excuse me, do you know anything about the Spoon of Cottage? What are you talking about? Tell me, what do you know about the origins of the Spoon of Cottage? Well, the origin's not so certain, but it might be a metaphor. An abstract metaphor of the spoon theory. Good afternoon, thank you so much for your time. You look like a nice, normal, grounded, local gentleman. I'm really hoping that you can help me here and shed some light on um, just the real, true origins of the Spoon of Cotteridge. Thank you. Aliens. <sighs> that was a ride. Um, I guess it remains a mystery. <laughs> Three years. I guess it remains a mystery. Um, come to Cotteridge. Visit the Spoon of Cotteridge. Only a great city like Birmingham can have an attraction like the Spoon of Cotteridge. Um, it's a beautiful place. Uh, tell the world. <laughs> and maybe someone, someone out there has to know. It's been three years. I just need to know. How did the spoon get here? How did it get here? Oh my God.